Bible says, believe on the Lord Jesus Christ, and thou shalt be saved. He that has the Son has everlasting life. He that has not the Son, the Lord Jesus Christ, shall not see life, but the wrath of God abiding upon him. The wrath of God is hell. It's plain and simple that for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believes in him should not perish. Some of these drivers do believe on the Lord Jesus Christ. Many fans do. But the problem is, too many fans do not. The Bible says, broad is the way that leads to destruction, but few will find the straight gate. Jesus said, I am the way. There is no other way. You're not good enough when the Bible says there is none good, no, not one. You're not righteous enough when God says, be holy for I am holy. But the Bible says there's none righteous. You're not going to get to heaven on good intentions. You're not going to get to heaven because you think you're going to get to heaven. You're going to get to heaven by what Jesus said. I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father but by me. Now you got to watch out because you're going to, from here to your, to your seats in the stands, you're going to come across false witnesses. They don't proclaim that Jesus is God. And yet the Holy Bible says that Thomas said, My Lord, my God, that's the one that's going to save your soul. That's the one that was virgin born. That is the one that suffered and died upon Calvary's cross and was buried and arose again the third day according to the scriptures. What is the difference between religion and Jesus? The empty tomb. The angels proclaim that Jesus Christ is not here. He is risen. Every pastor, every pope, every rabbi, every reverend, every man that goes behind the pulpit will be buried. It will stay buried until God resurrects him. But Jesus Christ who suffered and died according to the scriptures and was buried and arose again the third day. Where over 500 people witnessed the resurrected Christ. And he is seated at the right hand of the Father today. That is the same Jesus Christ, who is God, who is able to save your soul from your sins, the Lamb of God, which take away the sin of the world. And we're all sinners, for the Bible says, for all have sinned and come short of the glory. When you come short, you're going to fall into hell. And the only way to bridge that gap between you and God to get to heaven is by believing on the Lord Jesus Christ to be saved. Uh, there are no Baptists in heaven. There's no Catholics in heaven. There's no atheists in heaven. Born again, Bible-believing, blood-washed people under the blood of Jesus Christ alone get to heaven. Everything else goes into hell. There are good people in hell. Good people don't get to heaven. Those that are washed by the Lamb of God which take away the sin of the world, those get to heaven. By what Jesus Christ has done and not what we have done. Not of works, least any man boast. For by grace are you saved through faith. It's by grace and faith and not what man can do. The only thing man can do is he can die. The wages of sin is death. You're a sinner. Your sins will give you death. But the gift of God is eternal life. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. We're all going to die. Your death may be today. We don't know. You know, at this track years past, there's been accidents where tires and car parts have gone into the stands. It may go into you today. And you may not go to a hospital, but you may go to a morgue. And when you go to a morgue, the Bible says there is an afterlife, and the afterlife is heaven by Jesus Christ alone, or it's hell by anything or nothing. You may die today. You may die of a heart attack, you may die of a natural cause, you may die by an accident, you may die by heat stroke, but you're going to die one day. 
and when you die, your afterlife is determined by what you have done or what you have not done with Jesus Christ. You can go to church all you want. Church is not going to save your soul. You can be baptized. Salt water, fresh water, lake water, pool water, ocean water. But in hell you're going to wish, oh, if I just had that drop of water. That little drop of water to cool my tongue. The dying thief had no time for church. The dying thief had no time for baptism. And yet he believed on the Lord Jesus Christ. And Jesus said, today thou shalt be with me. Believe on the Lord Jesus Christ. And thou shalt be saved. 